Guys, Gabinator here one last time today with a, yet again another boss battle update. Now, I'm probably going to make this a series. We're going to build an entire boss battle. But basically, the thing here is that, so you've got your boss and you've got the button that activates um, the health bar. But the thing is, you don't want pe people to just keep on spamming the same button to reduce the boss's health. So to do that, I have came up with this. And it's very simple, I'm sure somebody's done it before, but it's basically an RS Norlatch hooked up to a piston. And so when you hit the button, the button can't be pressed anymore. So you can shoot an arrow at a button, and then, well, that's it. It's been shot, it's over, you're, uh, you're not getting your arrow back, and the button is not getting pressed again. And as a result, that has been pressed and once by that, and it can be never be pressed again by that. So you can have multiple of these hooked up to that. And that is how that is done. So I actually do have time to show you how to build it. So let's get right on to that. So you can start by your power input. Um, and this is hooked up to a very interesting kind of RS Nor latch I just made on the spot to work with what I had. Um... So, um, wait, so then that goes into that. Oh, right. Um, and then this goes into that. Wait, oops. Um, what happened there? I think I messed something up. Um, so this is it in a nutshell. <laughs> and so, it's an RS Nor latch, and it is hooked up to a piston. Uh, this design is looking awfully different. I wonder if I did something wrong. <laughs> I wouldn't be surprised if I did. Oops. Oh, right. Um, what? Okay, I messed something up here. I know it. Yeah, I messed something up. That's for sure. Oh, so then that goes into that, which then goes like that. Aha. Uh -huh. So, and then you just cover it up with red wool or whatever wool you're using, if you're even using wool. I like to use wool, personal preference, because wool allows you to discern different redstone lines. And then there you have it. You can press it, and you can press it once. And then if you have a reset button, just have it hooked up to that. And yeah. And that's pretty much it, in a nutshell. So, thanks for watching. Pretty short video. Hope you don't mind. Don't get mad, please. Um, uh, but yeah. yeah, these really are looking a lot different. Am I sure? Oh, and also one more thing to note is that um, I had it so that way there's an output like that. That and then that is what hooks up to that, just like that. Um, so yeah, that's it for today, and thanks for watching. See you all next time.